everybody, welcome to my barn tour. I just wanted to say I'm very thankful for all of the ponies and for everything. We got the stable second hand, so it didn't cost a lot of money. But I'm very grateful for everything, including the little boots. And I don't want to come off as bragging about what I have. I just thought I'd make this video to, um, hey buddy. I was just very excited. <laughs> and I'm going to set the tour now, sorry. We're walking into a stable. Outside we have two all weather products. This is Liam, my little baby mini pony. Hey buddy, he's very silly. He likes to snuggle a lot. Yes. And over here, it's Fleece. Fleece and Liam are best buds. And here is Stumper. But he's just in Liam's old little house. But then he got big and grew up and all of that fun stuff. Um, those are just my people. Um, that's me. Um, <laughs> this is Little, well, I call him Snoops for a sneak peek, but I also like, I have, I don't really know what best name for him, but he, or she, I can't decide. She's super sweet, probably the last pony I'll get because they cost a lot of money and I, I, I don't have endless money. I mean, I, I don't have any money left now, but I, I don't want to mean I'm still thankful that I have had some and He's, that those are beautiful and yeah he's the dressage pony and he likes to just jump out outside and this is teddy he is my hunter jumper pony and he just likes sleeping here they switching it up and he's trying to get into some of the i see you buddy don't. Okay, thank you. Good boy. Um, let's try and get the hair. Okay, I'll get a little bit. There you go. Here. Well, here. The tiny jump. It's very sad, but it, it works. And here's some bales to lace. And underneath it is a winnie. She's coming. Is a little prize. Sorry, I'm just going to type 1 diabetes if you didn't know. And that's my blood sugar. I also have a little American Girl Diabetes kit. Even though, yeah. Um, these staples are our generation, but they're second hand. So they came with a bit more stuff for a little bit. I recommend doing it. But here is Teddy and Snoop's halters. There's the water, the water too, and they are very good with food, except Teddy sometimes. But here are all their feeds up here. This one, I think this one is Snoops. Oh, well, Snoops, well, they all get treats from there. Uh, Snoops, uh, Sherman, a bit more food and some nice treats. And this little bowl and some baby powder for after when they're all wet and they need to dry off quickly before I go outside and some shampoo and stuff and some more food. It takes a lot to feed these guys. These guys have big tummies. No thanks. Hmm. Hello. New big board. Um, this is a way to do from my friend. Um, so I am just going a little, I have my dog's actually so you're stuck. Winnie, what is it? I feel low. Alert. See? She'll come good, girl. What is it? What is it? What? What are you doing? I love you. She's trying to alert my, me when my blood sugar's low. And I actually have a minute. She was holding up. And that's the diabetes kit. Um, that's supposed to be me. But she's the sweetest. I won't have her alert. I like, she alerted me, but I won't have her get juice or anything now. I'm in the middle of this, and I'm not going to get juicy though. But this, she's a very special princess, and I love her wholeheartedly. Yeah. 
some ASMR here. Anyway, she's still here. She's my emotional support dog. Well, service dog. But I cry in her sometimes. Anyway, <laughs> I'm not even sure, but this is my, my, my new saddle pad I got with, um, in the little west of the staple. I, I got also this saddle, but I find this one I got when I was six and it broke a bit. So I, I'm, I'm a bit hesitant to use these cause I don't want to break it. This one seems a bit sturdy, but I made these two saddles. I just had, I cut out paper and then taped it around it. And yeah. And here is the open. I'm sorry. One second. There we go. Sorry. This door opens. And as you come here, you see the first pony, the original pony showman. I love his foofy mane. I've seen some people untangle it. I didn't mean to untangle it. I just got carried away brushing him when I first got him because I loved him so much. And I love how his mane is. Before lock is all poof. You can't really get at him, and he's so cute. He's so he loves ear scratches. He loves all scratches. And here's my topic with my question. And this, I don't like using a bit, but I find just when I just do little tiny taps when needed, but I never want to hurt them or anything. And it's a feed thing. Um, because he does get extra treats because he's my baby and he does have a hay nut he's very lucky and some more hay and more hay i do spoil him quite a bit yeah that's probably why he's fat we don't body shame any horse because he's the cutest up here so i know my real brushes sorry about that and this and the white thing are blankets and here are saddle pads this I like using it as a martingale, like a ghost. Oh no, I mean breastplate, not a martingale, sorry. It's because it slides off of Teddy, who's a bit slimmer than, um, showman. And got uh, my boots, my miniature person. Here is a beautiful trailer. It's packed full with extra stuff, like blankets and things, mostly cloth, that I made saddle pads out of. If you look over here, this is my niche for me because she has a collar just like this, kind of. And this is her vest because my dog, Winnie, has a service dog vest. She's a real service dog. She was trained for two years at Lions Foundation. I can't talk, sorry. At Lions Foundation of Canada Dog Cuts. And She's still there right by my side. She's the best. This is me exploiting the amazing t-shirt. I, I really love it. And yes, yeah, where you can tuck them up. And over here is my vet scenario. I'm not sure. I know you guys are more horse people. But I, I want to be a vet. And I got accepted into the University of Guelph. And I'm gonna... I'm, I'm part, my goal is to become a vet. But... I'm, I might, I'm not sure which courses I'm going to take yet. And she's going to take because she's going to come there with me. Sorry, I'm still going low. Well. If you have diabetes, don't do this. Go and get yourself something to drink or eat um, sugar. But I'm a bad example. I'm okay for now. And this is little Cooper. He's just at the vet. He's not a linear pony. But he also came with a staple and free pony. Yay! Or oh, horse, technically. I just like being so cute. And this is a little person hugging the horse. Um, there's a cute little beanie boo. He's in there getting better. This, these came with the vet, and this came with a little stable. And they fit, and I was really happy about that. Really satisfying. And here's my vet clinic. Um, 
Sorry guys, this side, can't really see it, but it's like a little clinic and it has some treats and some food and some magazines at the bottom. And some animals. And I have a stethoscope, face mask, a collar. This is Fetch. He has, he's on a cone and there's a little scale underneath. And this can be a cute little examination table. And this is the x-ray. In real life, you don't actually, you, you don't want to get yourself ex um, exposed to radiation that much, so only when necessary. I, I lost a dog one, I'm sorry, but I don't know why I'm apologizing, I'm sorry, but here are the clipboards, some dog treats, some supplies, some more supplies. More supplies, kind of real supplies. And this, and this. And here I have my little cat. His name's Lloyd. He has a ventilator and a little tube. He keeps it. So, yes, this is my barn tour. Sorry for this was kind of long. Tell me what video you like next, but thank you so much for everyone who watches these. Even if you don't like them that much, I thank you for taking the time to visit me. And I'd like to give a shout out to Avery Toys Reviews. And she might see you commenting a lot of videos, but she's my cousin who actually made some videos with me. And we focus more on Schleck. And don't worry, I'm not leaving Schleck behind. I could talk her um, a riding lesson once, and she was very good at it. Um, but we're not leaving Schleck behind all your horses. I guess this is another kind of hobby to do and when I'm done with it, I'm gonna give it all away um, and donate it. So, so it is going back to good uses and the money that was bought at Groups to Diabetes Canada, which is a coincidence. So anyway, you can get by from showing He's sleeping almost getting up. Bye from this dude. I'm really gonna go and get something to eat because I'm wrong. And, um, and, thank you for watching. Bye. I love you all.